We're gonna start standing up today. All right, nice and tall. Let's just rock back and forth. And settle it in. Open your palms up to the front. Roll your shoulders down and back. Take a deep breath up and in. And exhale. Take a big breath up. And exhale. One more time, big breath up and in. And exhale, reach tall, lean it over. Come on up, lean over the other way. And come up, flip your palms, press them up and press them back. Keep them back behind your head and just open them up all the way down. Really open through your shoulders, shake them out a little. And let's just swim our shoulders back. Take your elbows. One more. And take it down. Walk your feet out wide. Let's take our feet out and point them out toward the corners and just slide your hips down and squeeze them up. Slide them down and squeeze them up. Take them down and up. One more time. Down and up. Nice job. Shake it out. Heel toe it in. Let's open our hips up. We're going to start standing today and working on a little bit of balance. Leg strength and some balance. And come on in. Good job. Big breath. Exhale, hands back behind your ears. Nice and tall. Let's take your right foot. Lift your knee, point your toes down to the floor. You know what I'm going to do before we do that? Is take our comments down so you can see my feet. But I'm so glad you're all here. All right, so nice right leg. Lift your knee, point your toe to the floor, and barely touch. Lift and touch. Lift, just barely the lightest little tap of those toes. Grounding through your left leg, right? Tiny little micro bend in that knee. And hold it up, right here. Hold it up, arms reach out. Take it down, nice job. Big breath. And exhale, hands behind your ears. Let's do the other one. Your left leg, point your toes to the floor, lift your knee, and tap. Lift, and tap. And then hold it up. Extend your arms out. Balance here, shoulders low. And take it down. Good job. Shake it out. Hip distance apart with your feet. Let's take our hands back behind our ears. Knees are a little bit soft. Remember, this is locked and this is soft. So it's still a straight leg, it's just got a little bit of give to it. We're gonna take our elbow, dip it down to the side, and come up. Other way, and come up. Take it down, and up. Down, and up. That's it. One more like this on each side. Reach up, stretch, press down, shake it out. 
All right, we're gonna do that same side bend exercise, but we're gonna add a little something to it. Hands back behind your ears. We're gonna side bend, and then take that top elbow, rotate it, and come up. Side bend, rotate, and up. Side bend, rotate, come back, and up. Side bend, rotate, come back, and up. Side bend, rotate, come back. One more time. Side bend, rotate, come back, and up. Drop those arms, shake them out. All right, right here, nice and tight. We do not know what happened there. Okay, nice and tight. We're gonna lift up our right knee. We're gonna just play with the right knee for a little bit. We're gonna lift it up and down. Arm straight, opposite arm comes up and barely touching down, right? Comes up, barely touch. That left leg on the floor, grounding in. <clears throat> Now let's add a little something to this. Knee up, extend that leg back behind you. Knee up. Remember, finding that spot on the floor in front of you and focusing on that is gonna help with your balance. Nice job, let's do two more. Last one, hold right here. Reach long, stretch that heel back a little further, that, those fingertips up a little further. And come on back down. Shake that leg you stood on, all those little supporting muscles. Now we're gonna try the same thing on your left side. So grounding through your right leg on the floor, pull that knee up, straight arms, just the knee at first, remember? Come on down. Woo, just the knee. All right, add that glute squeeze. So knee and glute. Knee. Remember, finding that spot that's not moving and focusing on that is going to help with your balance. If you're looking around, if you're watching me, you're going to wobble a little. One last time, hold it right back here. Reach back and down with your heel, up and out with your fingertips. And bring it down. Good job. Whew. You know that balance work is one of my favorites. Inhale and exhale. Arms up and then exhale, pull it back down behind you. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Reach up and squeeze it back behind you. Reach up and squeeze. One more time, stretch it up and squeeze it back behind you. Good job, bring it down. Let's do one more work, uh, one more balance uh, exercise before we move on. Knees are out, knees are soft, both of them, arms out to the side. Whew. Roll those palms up. We're gonna take your right toes, tap them front, tap them side, tap them back, side, and front. Now it's up to you. You can keep it off the floor the whole time. 
or you can tap in between. Hold it out wide. And lower it down. Shake it side to side. Big breath. Exhale. Roll those palms up. Stick that leg forward. We'll start forward. Tap it on the floor. Soft right knee. Out. Back. Out. Remember, you can keep it up off the floor. You can ground it with your toe touching. Working on that stability. Remember, when we move through our balance work, working those little stabilizing muscles, Hold it out to the side right here. And take it down. Woo, shake it out. Big breath. And exhale. Hands are on your hips. Let's take our right leg back into that lunge. Press your heel down. Come up onto your toes, reach it, and then press back down and hold. Come up on your toes, and then press down and hold. One more time, up, press down and hold, stretching that calf. Step forward and back, other leg goes back. Press your heel down into the floor. Come up and press. Come up and press. One more time, come up and press. And then rotate toward the front. Keep your feet wide. Open your hips, open your knees. Come on, down in that plie and then squeeze up. Down into your plie and squeeze up. Inner thighs, hamstrings, squeeze up. Squeeze up. And hold it down. Press your knees back, back. Four, three, two, one. Squeeze up and then toe heel it together. Nice job. All right, we're going to head down to the floor. Let's take a deep breath up and in. And then swan dive forward fold. Chest is leading all the way down. Relax your head, let it hang. Bend those knees a good bit. First forward fold of the day, still waking up our legs, waking up those hamstrings. Double bend and straighten. Double bend and straighten. One more time, big bend and straighten. Nice job. Whew. Send your hips side to side. Walk your hands out a step, walk your feet back a step into our down dog. Remember with down dog, we're taking our hips and pulling them up and back and then pedaling out. Sending heels toward the floor. Whew. Up onto your toes. Lift your hips, 
Lift your mid back and roll like a wave right into your full plank. Now let's try to reverse that. Pull up your shoulders, mid back, hips, and then your heels melt toward the floor. Let's wave again. Up, up, up into full plank. <clears throat> and then wave back. Up, up, up. Hold it in down dog and pedal it out again. Let's take your right leg, lift high. Open your hip, drop your heel behind you. Reach it up and rotate, take it down. Left leg, same thing, lift it up high. Open your hip, drop your heel behind you. Straighten it out and rotate. Press those heels toward the floor. And come all the way up onto your toes. Drop your knees wide, bring your big toes together. Sit your hips back in child's pose. You can rest your forehead on the mat. Walk your hands to the right, send your hips to the left. And then walk your hands to the left, send your hips to the right. Come on, center. And then send your hips forward. Tuck one knee under and have a seat. All right, so we're gonna be working this way in a, a, a big core section circuit. Nice and tall. Send your hips backwards and then sit up tall. Let's just lean back and hold and then come on back up. Lean back and hold and we'll come on back up. One more time. Lean back, hold right here. Tuck your lower back, roll down to your elbows. Place those elbows back behind you. Okay. So, let's get our setup going. So, instead of just lounging here, watching TV, I want you to take your shoulders, send them back, chest is open. Everything is up off the floor but your hips, right? Lower back is not down, it's up. Here we go, legs out at 45. Holding here. Take your right leg, drop it down and lift it up. Right leg again. Down and up. So good. Hold it up. Roll it to your lower back, pull your knees in. Extend them back out there. Lower back is back up off the floor. Left leg this time. Lower and lift. One more. And roll it back. Let's take it all the way back down onto the floor. Scoot you over this way. I want you to take your legs one out, point your toes, bring one in. And then big old bicycle and hold the other in. Giant bicycle and hold giant bicycle and hold. Right? Now hug both knees in. All right, so we have that down. We're going to add a little arm and crunch to it. We're going to lift up, giant bicycle and hold, and then come down. Lift up, another giant bicycle and hold. So right knee comes in, crunch up, hold, and take it down. Crunch up, Bicycle and hold. 
come down, crunch up, bicycle and hold, come down, crunch up, Woo. lift, and down, lift, One more. And hug it in, rock side to side. Take your arms back down to the side, your sides, and extend your legs long. Let's pull our knees in together and take them way out wide. So your hip is coming up off the floor. We're gonna extend long, come in the other way. See how my hip's up? Extend long and come in. Shoulders stay on the floor, but your hip lifts. One more. And hug it in, rock side to side. Place your feet on the floor. Arms are at your side. I want you to crunch up, lift your arms up, back, circle around, and down. Circle around and down. Crunch and down. Crunch and down. Whew. One more. And hug it in. Rock side to side. We're gonna do this for exercises one more time. Rock it up. Slide those elbows back. Come on onto your elbows. Open your shoulders, chest is out, legs come out 45 degrees. Nice and strong for your core, right leg lower and lift. Heels are together, toes slightly apart. Two more. One more. Hold it up. The other leg. Same thing. Hold it up. Chest is open. Two more. One more. Pull your knees in, roll back all the way down. Hug them in and rock side to side. Take your arms up over your head. Ooh, arms right here, over your head. Over your chest, sorry. Reach them up over your chest. Remember our bicycle, right? One leg long, the other one's in. Point your toes, crunch up, big circle and down. Crunch up and reach. Big circle. And down. Crunch up and stretch. Giant circle. Crunch. And down. Lift. And lower. Lift. Big bicycle. 
bicycle. One more. And hug it in. Nice, side to side. Hands at your side. We're going to take those knees side to side. Remember, extend your legs out. Bring your knees in over to the right. Lift your left hip. Extend out. Bring your knees in to the left. Inhaling as we're opening. Exhaling as we close. straight into the center. Rock side to side. Excellent. We're going to do the crunches and big arm circles again. Let's try to reverse those circles. Hands start at your side. We'll inhale, open, and close. One more time. Hold up. And all the way down. Nice job. Send your knees side to side. Hold it right here. Ah. And then we're going to roll onto our side. My cheat sheet printed. Um, front and back today and not on two pages, so I had to flip it over. Um, all right, we're gonna roll it onto your side. So you wanna obviously, the first side you use, gonna face me so you can see what we're doing. And then I want your head up in your hand. Long legs. I'm gonna come up here so you can see me a little bit better. But I've got my head in my hands. If this bothers your neck, you can drop down. As light as you can right here. I want you to stack your hips, stack your knees, stack your ankles, and as light as you can with that hand, right? You don't want to lean into it. It's your kickstand, but it's only there if you need it. Lift that top leg and lower. Lift it just to about hip height and lower. Just to about hip height. And lower. Now this time, lift it to hip height and hold. Bring that bottom leg to meet it. And then both go down. Lift, lift, and lower. Woo! Lift, lift, and lower. Lift, lift, and lower. more. One more. And down. Nice job. Walk it up onto your elbow. Elbows right below your shoulders. Bend that bottom knee. All right, so the top arm and the top leg isn't lifting. It's just going to follow. So we're going to come up, lift our hip. So see how it just follows? I'm not lifting it. I'm just 
This is a hip movement. Lift my hip. going to start all the way down again. Heads in your hand or all the way on your bicep. Long legs, hips stacked, knees stacked, ankles stacked. That little kickstand. You notice when you lift that bottom leg that that kickstand comes in more in play. We're using it a little bit more than just touching. All right, just the top leg to about hip height and down to about hip height, yeah, and down. You probably don't even really need much of that top arm here. Now here we go, fingers in place. Lift and hold, bottom leg comes up, and drop down. Lift and hold, bottom leg comes up. Lift, up. Nice. Give me two more. And one more. Good job. Walk it up to your elbow. Bend that bottom knee. All right, remember that top leg. You're not trying to lift it. It's just coming with you. Come on up and down. Lift your hip and down. Hip and down. One more. Hold it up. Reach over your head. And bring it down. Nice job. Come on up onto your hands and knees. Let's send your hips over to one side. Push it out there. And then bring your hips up and over to the other. Push it out. Hands and knees, we're gonna work into spinal balance. Remember that's one arm and the opposite leg lifting. So let's take your left leg, right arm, and extend it. Bend that knee back there and extend. Bend it and extend one more time. Bend it, extend and hold. Now that arm in front comes back high, right? Like elbow, whoosh, back, one more time, and lower it down. Okay, same side, pinkies in the floor, toes on the floor, lift, bend your knee, pull your elbow, extend, and tap. Lift, pull them in, extend, tap, lift. One more time, hold it in right here for four, three, two, one, reach, take it down to the floor, shake that arm on the floor out. Whew. All right, we're gonna move to the other side. Let's walk through it again like we did the first side. Right leg, left arm, opposite side. So just bend that leg and extend it. 
bend it and extend it. One more, bend and extend. And now pull that arm in right here. High, squeeze your shoulder blades or your shoulder blade. Squeeze it. One more, squeeze it. Reach it out and lower it down. Toe into the floor, pinky into the floor. Lift, pull in, extend, and tap. Lift, that's it. Lift, and down. Lift, pull, and down. Two more, up. Last one right here, hold it in for four, three, two, one. Take it down, shake it out. Woo, round your back. And release. All right, let's just do one more here. Take your right leg back, toes into the floor. We're gonna lift it, hold it. Take your left arm, circle it back, look at it, and then bring it back around. Tap it down. Lift, circle that arm back behind you, look at it. Come back and tap it down. One more time, lift, Circle your arm, come back, and bring it in. Other side, same thing, extend back, lift up, take that arm, opposite arm, look at it, and bring it back. Lift, and take it down. One more time, lift. And bring it back down. Send your hips, circle them around back there. Reverse the direction. And come on up, flip it over. Nice. All right, we're back into a boat pose. Or we are in our boat pose. We're gonna go into our boat pose. Nice and tall, sit up top on your hips, bones, sits bones, and then roll back behind them. Lift those feet, shoulders open. Bring your knees up, tabletop-ish. Try to get those shins parallel to the floor. We're gonna straighten both legs, one at 45 and one almost to the floor. Tap our hands underneath. Bring it center, then the other way, tap. Bring it center, tap, center. If you had like a Pilates ball or a block, you could transfer it here, right? Transfer it here. One last time. Drop your heels, reach your arms forward, stretch them. Stretch your back. And come on back up. Take it back into that same position. We're gonna take our hands and rotate them to the side. Actually our whole chest, shoulders and everything to the side and then up, center, side, and center. Add a bicycle leg, side, center, side, center, side, center, side, center. Four, 
three, two, and one. Nice job, drop your heels, reach forward. Come up, let's go all the way down to the floor. Long legs, long arms. Let's take your left arm right up to the ceiling. We're gonna sit up, take your right leg up, tap your toes. This arm is reaching out, see it there? And then everything comes back. Come on, same side. Inhale, exhale. One more time. Both arms overhead, big breath. Exhale, both arms to the side. This time your right arm goes to the ceiling. We're gonna sit up and touch those left toes. Reach that hand. it up and press to your side all right let's repeat those again boat poses again rock it up come into your boat pose get those legs at about tabletop with your shins roll your shoulders back split those legs and tap come in split them and tap come in split them Four, three, two, one. Drop your heels wide, reach through your feet. Come on back up, back into that boat. Russian twist with bicycle legs. Four. Three, two, one, hug it in, roll it all the way back down and just rock back and forth. Whew. And settle it down, drop your feet. Take your knees, drop them to the right. Look to the left, open that left arm out there. Brain center. Drop your knees to the left. Look right and open your right arm. And come center. Hug your knees in. Let's try to pull our knees in and extend our tailbone all the way to the floor. Right? So instead of pulling up with your hips, we're just pulling in, but those hips are extending down to the floor. That's it. Bring your head and shoulders up, tucking into a little ball, and let's just start rocking. 
keep that tiny ball, maybe balance a second up top, push it back, and not to your shoulders, right? Just mid back and hold. Mid back and hold. Mid back, right arm, left leg. Mid back, left arm, right leg. Mid back, right arm, left leg. Mid back, left arm, right leg. Mid back, stay in that ball right here, hold tight. Extend both legs, arms out, open everything up. Hold, hold, tight. We're holding for four, three, two, one, and let it all the way back down. Ah, so good. Whew. Why don't you extend that left leg long? Reach your right arm up over your head. Toes as far down as you can get them, fingers as far up as you can get them. And then release. Same thing with the other side. Right leg, left arm. Stretch. And come on in. Excellent job. Knees side to side. Hold them to one side. Roll onto your side. Hands and knees. Round your back, give it a good cat stretch. Tuck your toes, lift your hips. Walk your feet in, hang in forward fold. Grab opposite elbows. Bend your knees, round it up. Shoulders come back, head comes up. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. One more time, big breath. And exhale. Oh, thank you for joining me today. Oh, Pilates, Pilates. Um, remember, if you guys have suggestions, things you want to add into Pilates, let me know. Um, if you, you know, got a suggestion for doing something a different way, I'd love to hear it. Um, I hope everyone's doing great. Have a happy Thursday, and I will see you tomorrow morning, 9.30.